Hollis. Welcome back to Palm Beach Live Magazine. And tonight, I just got in basically from LA and I'm at Bradley's. It's on a Friday night and I had the pleasure of running into the hottest, incredible, and the most amazing people that are doing a fabulous German reality show. And here they are, William Cummins and How are you doing? Right, that's for sure. That's right, and they had the pleasure of meeting Marilyn Monroe too. So, hey, if you need a star for your show, you got it right here. So, let me ask you this because I have heard so much about you. You're the hottest realtor in Florida right now. I would say it's, it's, it's very kind of you to say that, but tonight I thought we'd speak about the German reality show. Oh, he doesn't want to talk real estate. Okay, so let's go to my star. You want to tell me what's going on with this reality show? Well, these are two young men that come here from Germany to the United States to bring the hottest fast food in Germany that's not even available in the United States. It's called the Dona Kebab, and it's the Dona Dream in West Palm Beach. And where is it located, the Dona Dream? Well, the first year of the show brought you to America, showed you a lot of changes, a lot of movement, and then at the end, to a little bit of a problem between the two partners, and then some money issues, and one of the guys left, and left Colin Reichart sitting here at the end of last year. So your role basically on the show is to Leaving. Uh, cause trouble? Oh well, yeah, you, you, know, you know you need a little drama. Missing. You know, you know I, I didn't ask for the drama, but the drama was there, is there. Uh -huh. And um, I'm staying strong, keep going, and yeah, bringing the business back on the feet. And here I am for the second season. And it doesn't get any realer than this. No, only skies in the middle. Yeah. So you're originally from Germany? I'm, I'm born and raised in Germany. I, I got like a German mother, blonde, blue-eyed, white woman, and an American father from North Carolina. And but I was born and raised in the. You got beautiful eyes. Thank you. Learning guys. Thank you. The two most amazing, good-looking guys next to me. Thank you. Thank you. So you want to tell me? Thank you. Thank you, Marilyn Monroe. You want to tell me a little bit about the show then? So the first time when we started shooting the show. The idea is that German people leave their country, go to another country to found their dream. Many of the German people are saying, what a bad idea, why don't you stay here, it's a wonderful place. The other German population is saying, go for it man, try something new. And every step of the way is a little drama. Every step is a cliffhanger. Okay, and you um, are based out of West Palm Beach now? Or yes, yes. you're based on place else? Yes, no, no, well we're based here, and um, the restaurant was here, and that's what we're gonna have the restaurant again. So your family, you're married or you have kids? I am married and I have a daughter. You have a daughter. Was, and this happened while the show was going on? Yes. So the tell me about was born that. Here. <laughs> well, we're, we're um, like, like he said earlier, we was like, well, my, my wife had the baby in St. Mary's Hospital. We had a very great experience. And um, she's like the first the real, first class American citizen. Oh my god, that's incredible. That's he's, really a, cool. he's an American about that tall. Oh really? Yeah. Oh, that's Long hair, blue eyes. I'm not married, Gloria, and I don't have any children yet. Oh, you don't? Well, so we still have hope, okay? The show. And then another thing I wanted to say is, when I was back in Germany and I looked at an interview that Heidi Klum, I'm pretty sure you know sure, Heidi Klum. I know her really well. And I, I heard her saying, well, every time I come to go to the States, I miss that food. So oh, I want to so came up. Donut came up, and I wanted to come in and have that food in America. Okay, so why don't you tell me exactly what a donut kebab is? It's a specially prepared spiced meat on a vertical rotisserie with a heat source in the back, always cooking, grease and impurities are falling out, only lean, delicious meat onto a fresh baked bread and uh, vegetables on top and a yogurt sauce. A delicious. yogurt yes. sauce. Oh, 
So you bake it or you just... The bread is baked okay. separately and the roast of the meat is uh, ongoing, uh, lovely texture. You cut it off in slices and it's delicious. And then nothing for nothing, it's a 5.5 billion uh, profit business. Like 5 .5 in Germany, 5.5 billion euro per profit. year, 17,500 shops selling and none here. Oh wow. That's awesome. Until we came here. Until you came here. <laughs> <laughs> so are you planning on going to Germany yourself? Because well, I'll have to bring him. I have to you bring, bring him. Germans are asking for him, hunting for him. I have to bring him. They're already oh waiting God. for him. He's They're a big for him. celebrity oh, yeah. already in Germany. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Where is the show showing right now? Is it's, it on TV or is it's it on showing. Internet? It's not only showing like in Germany. It's showing in Austria, Switzerland, Germany, and in some other European countries. I had people from Brazil contacting us, seeing it. And it's on the web also, the and Box the website. Web. Why, why don't you tell us where it is so that way we can maybe make Box. more famous. Vox, 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 V-O-X, is one of the largest networks in Germany, and their website has the Dona Dream in West Palm Beach. One of the episodes, you can find it on the website for Vox. Okay, and then you could log on to the web and just right. look for the name, yeah, yeah. and it's there. And I think uh, once the second season of the show, that's going to really break the ice, because we had record breaking numbers, but like, our viewership was like never before in that show. So, I'm pretty sure with the drama that we got coming up, that's just going to... Oh, gonna... I can't wait to see it. You've got to get the uh, <laughs> yeah. on this one. Okay. <laughs> so let me ask you this. Besides doing your real estate that we got to remember that you are a realtor, and doing the reality show, uh, is anything that you are really looking forward to help out with the planet? Because, you know, we are really killing ourselves, you know, not only our planet, but the animals, and we're... Things, like one of the things with our product is a very natural product, a very healthy product, and everybody is going to enjoy it without uh, impurities, without extra uh, additives. But we only serve with a special place that's uh, recyclable. We only use products that are uh, green. We only are aware, we're always aware of the planet. We're only trying to be as modern as possible and aware as possible. That's great. It's all green. You follow that too, yes, right? Yes. Especially because you've been from Germany. Yes. I know Germany has a lot of the uh, solar energy, you know, yes. that they... Yes, very, 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 yes, very, very, very big, big in Germany. Yeah. That's great. And we so, also want to uh, support the community. We appreciate the Americans have loved our food, the Americans have embraced our products, and they made these boys very welcome when they came here. Okay, that's awesome. That's really nice to know. Especially for your audience, so you want to know what you're doing for the planet. That's important, especially the show. One more thing that I was going to sort of throw out there, because I know that we always got to give. The more that we give, the more that God gives us back. And I'm, I'm a fanatic of charities, and I'm sure you have some charities that you're promoting uh, in the show, or you're trying to get it out there. So, um, you want to tell me a little bit about what you're planning on doing? Here's a couple of things that we uh, got involved with last season. We had a guy come here from um, Essen. He was so excited, he searched around on Vermont Street to find us, and his uh, aunt is a local caterer. So because of that connection, we were exposed to some charitable activities, and we were willing to help in any way charities, especially those that deal with children, families, right. or children That's and right. families in need. That's Wonderful. Don't you agree that giving agree, more agree, back to the world I, I, is a way of giving it back, especially through the show? Exactly. Yeah. exactly. Everything that, that we can support children in need, we're supporting. Perfect. One of the things that we found when we we're working on the show here is that the Americans gave us help. The Americans gave us courtesy. And these boys were very, very uh, pleased to have that uh, cooperation. And they want to uh, show uh, appreciation and give back to the American community that embraced them. That's the
Beautiful. Well, America? it's is is amazing. I'm so happy to get to know you a little bit. I didn't even know that you were so spiritual. My God, Thank I'm you. very Thank impressed you. by Thank both you. of you. It's a great combination. Thank you. So I will say I would love to have you again on our show on the second season, which is coming up soon, right? Are yep. you shooting now? Or well, we're in pre-production. Okay. Colin was in Germany for about five days. He did 16 radio uh, interviews. And That's it, 16? Oh, my I, I, was, uh, <laughs> I was unable to go because of the circumstances, but it was a kind of a cold time of the year also. Right. So I was... Uh, How is your German? Are you practicing German? Are you memorizing German? I'm, uh, I'm having a little difficulty with my German, but I'm sure that the German audience will be pleased to help me because the German people all speak wonderful English. We have many American uh, visitors from Germany, tourists from Germany, and they run up and down the street looking for us and we're so excited when they come and we're uh, pleased and we want to make them welcome. They all speak English to us and I'm going to be speaking a little German today. That's wonderful. So everybody should come to West Palm Beach and look at you and say, this is the person that I have in my cell phone now because he's like a big star, you the know? The thing, the he's thing is the thing is, with the Germans, they see him on TV, they see like the American guy with the hat, and for them it's really exciting because in Germany you would never meet, meet anybody. So that's his trademark, the hat. Yeah, it is, it is. So, <laughs> so we, it, it's amazing how, how the reaction is and how, how, how famous he got because of that hat. Because in Germany, they really, uh, we have people coming here, uh, stopping us, no matter, we go to the movie theater, we could be here on Comatis, no matter where we go, we, we run into Germans or Germans find us and they stop us and they're like well let me take a picture and let me you know buy the a first hat. time it happened I was going to the trunk of my car on Clamata Street and a woman about 45 or 50 years of age ran down the sidewalk shouting out my name in English she said Mr. Cummings I'm not going to hurt you I saw you on German TV I'm from Hamburg <laughs> eventually after the show in the second season. Well, we feel it. that as the popularity of the show increases, we're able to have a little bit of more influence. And we want to share back and forth with the community Perfect. between uh, Germany and America That's and do great. more between the two countries to promote welcome tourism right. and, uh, and help. That sounds fantastic. Well, I'm looking forward to the second season. It's been a pleasure having you on our show. You're fantastic. Thank you, Sally. Thank you. And you, Jeff, I, uh, I gotta have a hat. Okay, so you gotta start in line of hats. I've been telling them that. To. I've been you telling them that. It's friends. already, a, we got a cartoon. We're gonna come up with a cartoon. Yeah. No, I mean, but we have to have property here. This yeah. is an incredible property. Yeah. It's been a pleasure, you. you Thank know, you. All, Thank both you. of you are fantastic. Thank Great you. chemistry. Thank, Thank you. you so much. Thank okay, you. looking forward to seeing you again. Thank you. I'm Laura Kissel. Thank you so much for being with me, Palm Beach Light Magazine and Marilyn Monroe. Bye. Only sky's the limit.